Welcome to College Trigonometry. Uh, my name is Silvana Vester and I'll be the facilitator for this course. This is just a short introduction video so you can know how things are organized. So when you begin and you enter your course and you're in the home page, what you'll always see are some announcements and you'll always see only the most three recent announcements. So always, please, 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 always check your announcements. That's how we communicate greatly together, right? So here you'll have the whole list of announcements, okay? And then as you enter the course, this is a great article. It really talks about how the ancients had a tremendous precision within the, their use of trigonometry. Um, and you'll see why it's the base 60 versus base 10 numerical system, but you can read the article. It's very interesting. At the bottom of the home page, you have several buttons. Uh, of course, your syllabus, your is self-explanatory and course modules is where you'll find all your weekly modules as well as your syllabus modules and so on and so forth. Zoom is essentially going to be used for our office hours. So they're called student engagement hours, but they're the same as office hours and we'll be doing those through Zoom. These are This link will take you to the uh, uh, Zoom meetings and information for me and the care coaches. So we have a lot of availability for you and we're trying to make it as diversified as possible so you can get the help you need but here you want to come once you come to the home page you want to go to the start here page and you want to follow all the steps in here okay you want to read the syllabus you want to take the syllabus quiz and of course you're watching the orientation video you definitely want to register into my math lab and you're going to follow this video's instructions and you're going to use this tab here my lab and mastering and then once you're registered of course to do all your homework assignments and chapter tests and final exam and midterm, you're going to use this button, My Lab and Mastering, to go to uh, Pearson's platform. Okay. And then here, I just want to mention that you have a master course schedule, which is incredibly important. It really is the master that we will follow, right? So you'll know what's what to expect. It's got the whole semester schedule and I am really good about not changing it unless we have something like a hurricane or whatever I leave it there I, I try to make keep it as intact as possible I do want to mention that some students when they come into the home page rely on this coming up section and I really am un uncomfortable about that the master course schedule is stronger and more important than that okay now, um, let me just mention here that the buttons you'll use the most, of course, home announcements, uh, the modules, which we'll go through, grades are all housed in Canvas, and this My Lab and Mastering will help you when you go to Pearson. Uh, the modules show you your weekly modules as well as your syllabus, so you've got Canvas help, you've got uh, how the course is structured and policies, which is essentially a syllabus online. And then here's your weekly modules. You can see this is what you have to do for week one and then so on and so forth. I just want to point you to how this is structured. You've got usually a discussion and then an, acti an activity, activity first and then a discussion. And you have two uh, deadlines. You have the deadline for your original, original post that's based on your thoughts from the activity that you did and then the replies to your classmates. So be careful about that. Uh, I think the, the deadline is only for the original post, but there's a second one, so be careful about that. There's also videos that I make before the homeworks that are due. And I want to mention that the hardest material in this course is Chapter 6. Well, Chapter 5, some students think that too. But Chapter 6 is the most important uh, chapter in the entire book. And just to show you how in-depth this can get, Here's how many videos you have on it. And there's, I even broke it into parts because there's just so many videos, right? So you can see that, check that out. All right. So then I want to show you when you go to uh, Pearson's, my, you know, my using the My Lab and Mastering um, button, you'll be in the area in the platform where you can do all your assignments. I wanted to show you another area where you have more videos. It's right here when you're in Pearson multimedia library. When you click on multimedia library, you'll see this screen and here's some more learning aids. I particularly like the video and so you could say, for example, I'm going to do chapter three and I'm going to look at, for example, I don't know, section three, two, and then show what they have in videos. And they're really quite good. All right. So they have a lot of videos that are very specific to problems. So I think that covers it. Please contact me through Canvas Messenger. Uh, I'll be happy to answer your questions if you can attach a picture of your work, and we'll go from there.